everybody, this is Viola London. My name's Andrew. And I'm Ingrid. And coming up is our Coco Mademoiselle Intense review. So first up is the fragrance overview. Uh, Ingrid, you want to give us a bit of an overview? Yes, it's very heady, um, intense fragrance. Yeah, it is. Yep. Um, very um, high class, if I may say that. Mm -hmm. um, some keynotes were uh, used from the original Coco. Coco, okay, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, and it, 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 it's much richer yep. and fuller version of, yep. um, of the original. So next up is the, the scent itself. Ingrid, do you want to give us a uh, bit more detail on the scent itself before we move on to perfume notes? Well, it's very sensuous fragrance and the combination of tonka bean mm -hmm. um, and patchouli yep. and jasmine. jasmine yep. um, you have a bit higher concentration of patchouli in this mm -hmm. blend. Um, over the, the original the, cocoa. Over the original yeah, okay, uh, yeah. version. And um, it's nicely blended with uh, vanilla and, and um, amber. And was amber, it? It amber. Was, yes. Yeah, very nice. Now we on to the perfume notes. I'll Take go it for it. Okay, here we go. So we've got top notes of um, Sicilian orange. Um, we've got bergamot, lemon. Then we've got top uh, mid notes, sorry, of jasmine, rose, and fruity notes. And then we've got base notes of patchouli, tonka bean, labdanum, Madagascan vanilla, and white musk. Ingrid, what do you think of the bottle? Very well, nice. the bottle is beautiful, as yep. you all may know. Very uh, classic looking, yep. um, nice and clean lines, and it kind of reminds um, reminds of 1920s Art Deco yeah. design. Yeah, Art Deco period, it? for sure. Yeah, absolutely, very much. I think I've said it before, very Poirot-like. <laughs> Someone's going to get murdered on the train, but hey, I'm sure your community will be fine. Next up is longevity. Ingrid, long-lasting, not long-lasting, middle of the road, super long-lasting. It's Where very, are we? It's very long lasting. It is in very my long opinion, lasting. It's yeah, very long yeah. lasting. Definitely four plus hours, if yeah. not. Yeah, if I not mean, longer. If, yeah, I mean, we, we said um, in the full article, which is in the notes, we do say four plus hours, but I think it's probably even longer, isn't it? Yes. We, we found very, very good um, long lasting fragrance. We're up to season to wear for this fragrance, Ingrid. How did it make you feel? Sort of season to wear? Um, well, it's more autumn and winter yep. fragrance. Okay. Definitely that makes autumn and winter. Although, you know, I try to wear it in the summer. I don't think it works that well. But yes, yeah. autumn, winter, mm -hmm. uh, quite intense. Mm -hmm. uh, and I would say all day round perfume. Yeah, so it's a daytime, nighttime, mm. any time of day, but autumn, yes. winter more so. Chanel as a brand doesn't really need much introduction. It it's classy, it's iconic, it's got history. Mm. Um, and you've, you've probably seen Kira Knightley um, is the main face of in the recent Coco, media campaigns. Mademoiselle mm. Intense in the media campaigns. Mm. So just watch out for those adverts. Finally, we make it to the summary. Ingrid, give us a summary on the fragrance. What, what do you think in general? Well, I feel this, this fragrance to me is very strikingly elegant. Mm -hmm. It is. And very intense. Um, very Chanel. Very Chanel. Um, that's right. And it's perfect fragrance for autumn and, and winter, as we said. Um, without being, you know, too sweet. Yeah. Thanks to um, vanilla and... Um, yeah, musky and as musky well, isn't notes. it? It's got some floral, got some citrus. Yes. And I think it'd be a good gift as well. I, I certainly feel it'd be the kind of fragrance you could always buy and buy it and, and gift it to someone as long as you keep the gift, give them a gift receipt. But it's just one of them fragrances. I think it's a good all-rounder. You can, you can never go wrong yeah, with Chanel. Yeah, you can't go too far wrong with Chanel. So that about wraps it up today for our Coco Mademoiselle Intense review. Um, don't forget to hit the subscribe button wherever the heck that thing's located. Um, more information is in the show notes of this full article for this. And... Do us a favour and give us a like, please. I'm sure it really hurts Google's, uh, Google's, YouTube's logarithm. And finally, just to let you know, we have a monthly perfume giveaway. So if you're interested, full information is in the notes also. Thank you very much for viewing. Take care. I've got a lot of stuff in the blooper reel. I think I've got more stuff in the blooper reel than I have <laughs> for the poor viewers. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>